Okay, so I just wanted to do a real short video on um, three pages that I did when I went scrapbooking last Friday. Uh, and, you know, I, I do these layout shares because I'm hopefully inspiring you because I know when I watch YouTube videos of people who are doing um, process videos or <clears throat> scrapbook pages, um, I get inspired. So hopefully that works for you guys as well. Now, I'm starting out with, um, my husband took me up to the Hollywood sign, and you know, I'm embarrassed to say I'm a native Californian. I've never been up there. The actual road that you can drive up and park and then hike up there at the time that we went was closed. Um, I believe it's open now, but all right. <clears throat> One thing I did differently this time when I went scrapbooking was I didn't use my Cricut Explorer. I went and threw my stuff and I got some oh I think I got this at either peachycheap.com or scrapbook daily dealers or something like that um, if you ever you know subscribe to their I mean not subscribe but um, follow their channel you get some really good deals now this was an actual packet and it came with um, this is this was a 12 by 12 sheet that I cut down but it came with these um, special little fold outs that would be great for um, a mini album if you're doing that or you know a regular album I guess where you're not slipping it down into the the sheet and it's all Teresa Collins so I got the enamel dots I got some little chipboard um, pieces I got this stamp set as well some brads and little tag things and then I got this beautiful six by six paper pad that is um, very similar to the papers that it came with, which I'll show you here in a second. Um, yeah, this was the 12 by 12 that I cut down the little tags and I got two of these. And it came with a bunch of different kinds of borders. I don't think I need to pull those out of there for you. Set that aside. And then as you can see, I used uh, some of these little cutouts. Now it came with two of the pages of the cutouts, um, which is great. And then all this paper. And I'll just show you. Um, so the way I organized it is I put, uh, you know, one pattern side of the paper up like this and then the back side. So just going through, look at how cute that is. Um, love this. I had glitter all over my crafting table. It was funny. Um, these are really pretty. The, the gold really is just gorgeous. Um, some some calligraphy type paper and wood. Some more numbers. And these are very, very cute on cards, by the way. You cut these out and you can put them on your cards. Um, and then another page of journaling tags. So that's what came in the whole entire kit. And this is what I came up with. Um, like I said, I didn't use my Cricut. So um, I did the You and Me tag. And um, I used the gold bo border that it came with. And I cut that so that it fit right there with the two. Um, they're not journal tags, but they're saying tags. And then there's the gold. I love these sayings, by the way. Um, this is my husband taking a picture. There's some kind of a lake or something there. Um, I know the name of it. I just forgot. Um, Lake Hollywood. There you go. I made that up. And then there's the Hollywood sign. And then I took some of the banners from that and just put it underneath here. This was like a little tab that I slid right on the picture. Used um, These enamel dots are not from that kit. I used different enamel dots. And then I had a little um, punch out here that is an, it was an exact circle and I cut it in half and slid it under here. And then I also put the um, little chipboard faux buttons, I guess you would call them. And then just another little thingy there and a little us thing and that was it. Um, I like the simplicity of this, but also I love the sayings on here. It's just so pretty. All right, then I did my son's 19th birthday um, pictures. And for this one, I pulled out another kit that I had got and I'm just getting it here. And this also came with brads and things like that, but I think I, they're still in my um, scrapbooking stuff. Came with a six by six, great paper. And this is just a piece of the 
scraps that I had. And I came with these um, letters and, and numbers and some little sayings right here. So I used that. Some more scraps, but look at how cute this is. All of these banners, I used these here. Um, I didn't tell you, this is Fancy Pants. And it came with some sticker borders and then um, the paper as well. And it looks like the name of this is Trendsetter. So you have some large chevrons, some solid sheets, some stripes. Um, let's see what else we have here. Um, oh, cute for even layouts or, or cards. Either one. Or you not have to cut them. You can just leave it like that. Um, let's see what else we have here. Oh, very nice. And then I used the other one of this. It comes with, you know, two of each uh, pattern. And some other numbers. Oh, that one's cute too. And uh, these as well, you could cut those and use those as, you know, borders that go across your page. And like I said, it came with brads and stuff. And I apologize. I thought I had everything set out here, but all right. So kind of different. I used a striped paper here. This is the two page layout. And then I used the dotted paper here. And I just put a bunch of stuff on here. But the one thing that I wanted to show you, and I think I've seen this on um, YouTube uh, video before, and I can't remember who it was, but they wrapped the twine around the um, photo mat, and I really, really liked that. So, and um, another thing I did differently than I normally do is I took the, um, I think this is a, a six by, no, this is, I cut this down to um, eight by eight, I think, but I used a six by six um, dotted paper on this half. And then I brought the stars one here, and then I put the pictures on top of it. Oh, one of my little bows. That's not supposed to be there. I need to, I didn't have blue dots with me, so I used regular glue. I think that's why that fell off. Just the journaling tag, and then you had these banners here, and then I put the little um, stickers there. And I think, yeah, these were the um, foam thickers, I believe those are too. And I just made the little banners there. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you oops, the camera. Oh, I did some chevron with my punch here, and then I just did a strip here, and I did some little letters where it just says enjoy. I found this in my stash of birthday stuff, and um, these here are big chipboard letters. Uh, I think those are from Thickers as well. And just added some other little stuff here and there. Um, that one says, that's my boy, or I love that boy, if you knew that. I called him boy. He probably, and then the same old tradition <clears throat> that I always do with my family is I get um, balloons, whether it's number balloons or just colored balloons, and I put them in front of their door and I put toilet paper in front of it. So when um, they walk out of their door, they have to break through the toilet paper. So I know it's silly, but it's fun. All right. So those are those three pages. Uh, if you have any questions, if I didn't cover any, everything that you saw on here, um, just leave a comment and I'll get back to you. Thanks so much for letting me share this with you. Have a great day.